Hello, welcome. Take a moment and read this problem, try it out, and then press play when you're ready to solve it with me. We're told that the formula below can be used to model which, or asked, excuse me, the formula below can be used to model which scenario. So notice this formula tells us that a sub 1 is 3,000. So this is going to be a sequence where the first term is 3,000. That is a sub 1. Then we're told any term in the sequence equals 0.8 of or times the previous term, a sub n minus 1. That's just the 1 before whatever term you're looking at. So if I want to find the second term, I take the first term and multiply that by 0.8. What do I get there? Let me just pull my calculator real quick. So 3,000 times 0 0.8, 2,400. All right, so we take our second term is 0 0.8 times the second minus 1 or first term and we get 2,400 and so on and so forth. All right, so any term in the sequence here, a, a sub n equals 0 0.8 times the term before it. Okay, so would it model the first situation? The row of a stadium has 3,000 seats and each row thereafter has 80 more seats. Well, that would be a arithmetic sequence. This is a geometric sequence because we're multiplying each term instead of adding or subtracting. And choice two is very similar. The last row of a stadium has 3,000 seats, and then each row before has 80 fewer seats. It's kind of a sequence that works in the other direction, but you're subtracting a constant amount. And then choice three says a bank account starts with a deposit of 3,000, and each year it grows by 80%. In that case, a sub n would be equal to 1.8 times a sub n minus 1. In other words, 180% of the previous term. So not what we have here. The initial value of a specialty toy is 3,000, and its value each of the following years is 20% less. Or 20% less is just 80% of what it was before. And you can see that happening here. We lose 20% of 3,000, we get 2,400, right? Because 20% of 3,000 is 600. And we're losing value, the toy is worth less um, over time. All right, well, I hope that helped. That was number 10.